INA, Internet Assigned Number Authority, right? So they are responsible for distributing these IP. So this protocol, like many other protocols like HTTP, TCP, UDP, etc., is responsible for establishing communication in most of our networks, basically. Okay. Your IP addresses, guys, you all know, it's your numerical label assigned to each device which is connected to what? To your computer network. That uses your internet protocol for communication, right? So, when we talk about IP, do you know how many octets are there? If for example, if I take a random IP, something like this. So, each one over here, like for example, this 192 is one octet. Each octet is having 8 bits. Each octet over here is having 8 bits, guys. So 192, this is your first octet, second, third and fourth. Four octets are there. If I talk about very first octet, it will be expanded like this. 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, dot second one one two three four five six seven eight dot i'm writing in the next line one two three four five six seven eight or this one zero one and last one one two three four five six seven eight okay see we have eight bits right when we convert them into decibel format this is what this i'm taking one octet example okay this is referred to as your two to the power zero right the very first one doesn't it it will be a two to the power one two three four five six and seven if we calculate these things two to the power zero is equals to what two to the two to the power zero one right two to the power one equals two this will be four eight sixteen thirty two sixty four one twenty eight if we add all of these things what will it be the number two fifty five that is the reason we get two fifty five as a maximum value make sense Right, so you might have always remember that last number, like the maximum number over here, five p will be like this, doesn't it? This is the maximum, the last one, correct? For every octet, two fifty five is the max value it can attain. Make sense? Correct? 